In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to join two pieces of skating board together, what I call a splice joint or a splayed heading joint. Now, this is better than just putting the two pieces of skating board up to each other because it gives you a big surface area to put some glue on to stop any joints opening up. Plus, you can blend it and sand it a lot better than just a butt joint and the joint becomes virtually invisible once it's filled and painted. Now it's just made up of two 45 degree cuts on either end of each piece of skirting board. This one as you can see I've already cut and fixed into place. So now we need to measure for the next piece. And I've already cut a scribe joint on this end of the skirting board. So I just need to measure up to the other piece of skirting board to find out where we need to cut this piece. It's important to get an accurate measurement here, otherwise you might be left with a gap or need to cut a bit more off. Now that I've marked the length of the skating board, I just put an indication mark of which way the mite is going. Then I square the line across the back so I know where to cut it. Once that's got a little bit of filler in it, it'll be virtually an invisible joint. Before you assemble a joint, just put a little bit of wood glue on it. This will hold the wood together and stop any paint from cracking. As you can see, now that the skirting board's been filled, sanded and painted, you can't even see where that joint is. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the videos. See you next time.